Light travels as a transverse wave. The light that we detect with our eyes is called visible light. We can see an object when light is reflected off an object and into our eye. So for example here, for us to see the football, the light from the sun will travel to the ball, be reflected off of the ball and into our eye. There are no particles in space, it is a vacuum. Unlike sound, light does not need particles to travel. Therefore, light can travel through space. Light travels much faster than sound. Light travels at 300 million meters per second. It takes approximately eight minutes for light to travel the 150 kilometers from the sun to earth. Objects that emit light are called luminous. The sun and light bulbs are luminous objects. Objects that do not emit light are called non-luminous. Most objects are non-luminous, for example footballs, books and apples, but we can see non-luminous objects when light reflects off of them and into our eyes. Light can travel through gases, for example air, it can travel through liquids, for example water, and also some solids. When light can go through objects, we say the objects transmit light. Objects that transmit light are either transparent or translucent. Glass is transparent as it transmits light. Most of the light that hits the glass goes through. Some light will also be reflected. Translucent objects also transmit light. Frosted glass is translucent. Some light that hits the glass goes through, but the light that is transmitted is scattered. Therefore, you do not see a clear image through translucent objects. Some light is reflected. Again, the reflected light is scattered, so the reflection is not clear. Objects that do not transmit light are called opaque and that means the light does not go through these objects. Most of the light that hits an opaque object is absorbed and some light will also be reflected. Hi guys, if you enjoyed that last video then please click on the screen to subscribe. You can also find all my videos in one place at GCSCRevisionMonkey.com. If you're a teacher, check out the Key Stage 3 package at ScienceSurgery.com it contains all of the Revision Monkey videos as well as loads more Key Stage 3 resources.